Hey guys, welcome back. So today I'm going to react to Gabriel Henrik, but this is going to be one of your requests and you suggested for me to react to his vocal evolution, which I'm kind of really excited to see. And it's going to be from 2003 to 2020. So it's like minus three, three and a bit years from like present day. But I mean, till 2020, he probably had basically the same vocals that he has now. So I'm more interested into like the early days of his like childhood but where he's coming from and how he sounded even back then so yeah i mean without further ado let's get into it Okay, that's a good vocal. I mean, going back to that 2003, he was 7, 8 years old, though, and that's impressive. Okay. That was him being 12 years old. 13. Going into puberty, I feel like. Rounds have been there since day one. Literally. And the guys. And he's 15, like, hold on in puberty. And he thinks of rounds. So basically he has sing every year of his life. On like stage, stage, not like just like voyage or something but on stage like soloist. That was beautiful. 19 years old. Yeah, I feel like 18, 19 is the moment when he went into this. Also playing piano and singing at the same time. 
That is really impressive. So much emotion, it's control. So can you lock whistle at 22? The game. This is 2019. 22 years old. I love that there's so much power in these higher registers. It doesn't become shriveled up, thin. It's so huge. to turn out to be wow okay you guys Starting from the beginning, I went back and checked like which year he is born, I was right, like 1996. So the first performance that we saw there, he was 7 years old. And to have that voice at 7, I mean he has a gift. He has an actual gift, like obviously he has worked on his voice and like his stage present presence and everything, but that's a natural, natural talent that is in him, like embedded in his core, in his DNA. Like that's insane. And to see him like actually being on the stage throughout his whole teenage childhood years, like he has been on the stage as a solo person, not just like in the choirs or whatever, but groups of people, he has been singly like singing on the stage, which is really impressive. I haven't seen a lot of people actually do that. And to see for him do that almost every single year of his life is so cool. I mean, it really shows the person is dedicated for music and vocal and just learning how to just do his best thing that he can do. And I feel like, yeah, he really got into Gabriel Henry that he is today. He's around age 17, 18, 19. He, that bracket is when he... I mean, I feel like 18 is the turning point for him vocal, at least from these performances here. Like, you can hear his voice now from there. Like, 
I mean, of course, and then he unlocked whistle and everything. I would also, also would love to know when he discovered that he can do a whistle, because I feel like he can now sing higher than when he was a like a child, which is insane to think about, because it sh usually is go a different way. As older you get, your register kind of can come lower, but I guess if you are not practicing, like, and not working out that muscle, it can, like, go down, but if you are all the time, like, doing work on it, it becomes stronger and better and more versatile so and in his case that's actually what is going on like he's like through the roof at this point and also the lows that he just delivered there were also insane like his his range is humongous and the control and depth and strength and understanding on what what to do is on point like the emotionality in there is amazing so thank you so much for suggesting for me to react to this video i don't know if i would come across it this soon if I if it wasn't for your comments so yeah I really really enjoyed this video and uh, it really showcased his abilities from a really young age so yeah what are your thoughts in the comments down below when you think he was his turning point into Gabriel Henry that he is today from this these performances let me know in the comments down below also if you have any other suggestions for me to react to him please let me know in the comments down below I really appreciate that but other than that thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time Bye.